So a fight turns to gunfire at a Metro Mexican restaurant, and now several people are facing charges. News 4's Natalie Clydesdale has the video. Investigators say the two suspects got into a fight around 3 o'clock on the morning on Sunday and drove away. Then about 20 minutes later, they came back and fired multiple gunshots into this occupied restaurant, and you can still see the damage from the bullet holes here. Uh, there were several patrons inside. Security cameras capturing bullets fly into a busy restaurant early Sunday morning. Police say Noe Vasquez and Jose Peniagua Castro walked into Taqueria Mi Pueblito around 3 o'clock. Had started an altercation with some of the patrons inside for unknown reasons. The violent brawl involving Vasquez spilling out into the parking lot. <laughs> Court documents say Vasquez appeared to have lost the fight and was bleeding when he and Peniagua Castro drove away. But the violence escalating just 15 minutes later. Arrived a short time later in, in a different vehicle. Video shows Vasquez shoot around into the car's floorboard before he and Peniagua Castro step out of the car and fire what appears to be at least 10 gunshots into the occupied restaurant. Two people were um, injured with they were treated at the scene, minor injuries. One was a, a graze wound, the other one uh, believed to have been struck by some uh, metal shavings or, or shrapnel. The duo caught fleeing the scene, but were arrested earlier this week. They're now locked up in the Oklahoma County Detention Center. In Oklahoma City, Natalie Clydesdale, Oklahoma's News 4. Now other charges could follow, but right now the men are facing a charge of firing a gun from a vehicle.